I'll give you like a little short backstory. So like three years ago, I was working uh, beach chairs. Like I live in Florida. So that's like, you just, you make decent money doing that. So it's working like 50, 60 hours a week. Like it was nuts uh, during the summers. And at the time we went to my friend, uh, family friends, David's house for Thanksgiving. And David's this very successful entrepreneur, um, got bought out by Lowe's and then retired and all this stuff. I was talking to him. I was like, David, this just, this is like miserable. Like I can't imagine doing this for the rest of my life, like working like, you know, 40, 50 hours a week. Um, it's just like exhausting. And especially for someone else, like I'm not building like a, a, a legacy for myself. I'm not building a name for myself. I'm just helping somebody else make more money at, at the end of the day. Um, and so he really taught me kind of what he learned and the power of investing. And that's kind of where I dived into. And it's been great ever since. I haven't really looked back. I've just trying to been better myself in every aspect I can, um, whether it's fitness, my businesses, my uh, relationships with others, knowledge. So, yeah. How do you, uh, how do you measure your how do you measure your success or in a way of every single month or every week or every year, if you're getting better or not, do you, do you keep tabs on that? Do you measure that? And if so, how? Yeah, I, I, I definitely get asked this a lot, but it's, I'm, I'm more look at it. I don't look at anything past two years, like in, in the future, because it's, you just never know what's going to happen, you know? And I pretty much at the end of, uh, every month I kind of do like a reflection of what I was doing and where I was putting my time because that's the biggest thing. Like time, I, I don't like money's whatever, like I can always get money, but time for me is the most valuable thing. Um, and so I, I really look like where am I, I'm putting my time where I could be not putting my time, you know, whether it be like scrolling on social media or some, some mindless activity like that. Um, and that's kind of how I look at it. 